back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Susanna and today we are going to be tackling a huge project that I'm honestly a little bit nervous about. <laughs> we are going to be cleaning out my closet. I'm going to be going through all of my clothes, all of everything and just cleaning it. Cleaning it, organizing it, deciding what is going to be donated, what I am going to keep. And so yeah, it's probably going to take me a really long time. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I have a lot to do. I am going to start by taking everything out of my closet, which is a ton. It's going to take me probably quite a little bit, but I'm excited. I am going to dig in. I'm going to make a couple different piles. I'll probably make a pile of things that I need to get rid of, things that I want to keep, and then things that I kind of need to try on again and just see how I'm feeling about it. I have things ranging from shoes to clothing to um, purses, just all kinds of stuff that I just need to take out and totally clear. So I am going to go ahead and do that and then we'll start going through all of the clothes and the stuff and deciding what I should keep and what I should get rid of. Alrighty, you guys, I pretty much have everything out of my closet and it is covering my room. Honestly, this is kind of embarrassing. I didn't realize how much stuff I just had built up in my closet. So this clean out is even more needed than I originally thought, but I'm going to show y'all everything that is in my room right now. I'm kind of embarrassed. Ooh, bear with my messiness. So let's go ahead and look at it. Okay. <laughs> Here's lots of shoes and purses, um, stuff over here, and then the scary part, the bed with all of the clothes. I definitely have my work cut out for me, so I'm gonna go ahead and just start sorting through everything and making different piles of stuff that I don't want anymore and stuff that I do want, and it's gonna take me a little bit, but let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so the very first item that I want to get rid of is this sweater, I got this at Express, it was on sale. It was when they were going out of business in Little Rock, so I picked it up, I didn't try it on, but it just wasn't very flattering on me. And I have yet to get rid of it just because I haven't worn it, but it's not an excuse to keep it. It's just not the most flattering thing in the world. So I think I am going to get rid of this. Yep, I'm gonna be here all day long cleaning out stuff. Ah! What have I gotten myself into? So I have some sweaters now. I absolutely love this one. I think it's super chic, super cute. So I am gonna hold on to this one. Also, I love this one. I think it's so fun. It has some little sparkles on it. I don't know if you can see, but I'm also going to hold on to this. Okay, so this shirt I really love. This one's really cute because it comes down on the shoulders and I think that it is a perfect summer shirt. I do think that I'm going to get rid of this one. I don't love how like there's this is awkward tan thing, right? Right there. I don't know. This is just not my favorite shirt, so I will be getting rid of this one. Honey has decided to jump up on the bed. I think she's regretting it. Is that comfortable for you? Girl had a lot of clothes hangers here. Let's maybe you can go sit on the couch instead. How about that? Can I say hi to everybody? Mm-hmm. Mm you wanna say hi? Honey says hi everybody. She says hi. Honey also says, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it or if you think she's cute. So now I have a couple shirts from when I kind of worked in the corporate world. Now I'm a teacher, so I don't wear as nice of stuff anymore. Still nice, but you know what I mean. I don't really ever wear this shirt anymore. It is pretty cute, but I think that it could find a better home. And then I have this shirt, which I'm not the biggest fan of this layered look anymore. I want something more flattering, so I am going to say goodbye to this one as well. So I have this skirt, which I actually made when I was in college. I was in fashion school, and so... <laughs> As much as I love it and as much as I've held on to it because I did make it, it's honestly not very flattering on. It is one of the first things that I made and it kind of looks like a little squirt. I don't know. I just don't think that I want to hang on to this so I am going to get rid of this. Okay, as far as a couple dresses I want to get rid of, well this one's actually a romper and I think that this is actually so, so cute and I really like it and I really wish that I could keep it but it is just too small. I remember trying to wear it to my brother's graduation and I about died. And so I think I got it because I mean it is an extra small so it is tiny 
that I got it because it was on sale and I was like, this is so cute, but I just, I can't breathe in it. So even though it's adorable, I'm going to have to say goodbye to it. A couple of things that I do want to keep is, so I have this little blue polka dot dress. I think it is so cute and so fun, especially for the summer. So I am going to hang on to this. I also have this romper that I got from Francesca's and I don't know what it is about this one, but most rompers don't fit me very well. And I love this. It just, it fits so well. So I do want to hang on to this. And I also have this little black dress that I think, you know, everyone needs a little black dress. It's really cute. It's kind of hard to show the actual shape of it when it's on the hanger, but it has little polka dots on it. So I am going to hang on to this. I do really like it. Okay. So I'm almost through all of my clothes. I obviously did not show you guys every single item because that would be a very, very long video. And I don't want to have to put you guys through that, but I have a couple of like little accessory buckets that I think I'll go through really quick. Let's see, I have these two hats. These are the hats that I honestly wear the most. So I think I'm gonna hold on to these. Let's see, I have this headband. I think I'm going to get rid of it because honestly, this one is really tight and let's see, I'll double check. Yeah, it gives me a headache. So I am going to get rid of this. I do have these two headbands and I absolutely love them and they're not too tight. So we'll keep these. I'm gonna keep going through and I might show you guys a couple more of the things, but I'm not gonna show you everything. Okay, um, I have another pair of gloves here. I think I'm going to get rid of these, even though they are kind of cute, but this little bow is falling off and I think I'm gonna get rid of that. Okay, so I think I'm gonna keep this. This is really cute and fun, especially for a night out. So I'm keeping this. Let's see, ah, this is fun, but I feel like it's not, I don't know. So do you guys ever have that issue where you keep something for so long and you think it's still cute, but then it's like, wait, is this, still in style i don't know maybe that's just me but i think i mm -hmm, mm -hmm, i might hold on to it for a little bit longer let me know if i should get rid of this if it's out of style because sometimes you just you just don't know okay i am gonna get rid of this guy so yeah now we're through the accessories so I'm finally on to shoes. Um, let's see, I think I am going to get rid of these. As much as I loved these for teaching, you can see like right here is just kind of worn out. So I think I should get rid of these even though I have loved these. Also the bottoms are just like scraped smooth. So there's been a couple times that I have slipped in these. So yeah, these are gonna have to go. So these are some of my favorite little booties ever. My boyfriend's mom actually got these for me. So I am definitely holding on to these. I think these are so fun and so cute. So yeah, we're definitely going to keep these. Okay, another fun pair that I do wanna keep are these. I think that these are really fun and they make me look nice and tall. So I love these. We're gonna keep these as well. Oh, okay. This is taking a lot longer than I thought it would, but it'll be so worth it. I'm excited to see the final result and to show you guys what my closet looks like now. I did realize I didn't take a before, but if you wanna see what my closet looked like before, you can check out my room tour video. Um, I kind of briefly show it to you guys and I will link that in the description below. Oops. Sorry guys. But I will link that in the description below so that you can see it. Okay, you guys, two pairs of shoes specifically that I think I'm going to get rid of. Let's see, number one, I think I'm gonna get rid of these, mainly because I have another pair that looks a lot like them, as you can see, and I think I like these a little bit better. So I am going to get rid of these guys. I also think I'm going to get rid of these. I've had these a while and I just never wear them. So I am going to give these guys a new home as well. Okay, so I am pretty much finished with decluttering everything. It took me like about a good two and a half hours. So definitely took a while, but let me show you kind of the pile of clothes, shoes, all of that stuff that I'm going to get rid of. Okay, so we have quite a bit of stuff. Like you can see this big old pile that I will be getting rid of so this is honestly going to be so nice so therapeutic here's all of the clothes hangers that i have free now so i definitely did not realize how much stuff that i had that i needed to get rid of so my closet doesn't look too terribly different there's definitely a bit more space than there was before but it does look very organized and so i am happy with how it has turned out so let me go ahead and show you what it looks like now. Okay, you guys, so walking in, this is now kind of what it looks like. It looks very similar, just 
slightly more spacious. This is also really hard to show because I do have a small closet, but um, I just have those organizational bins right there. I have all of my clothes that I did decide to keep, some extra pillows, Honey's cage. Over here, I then have my shorts. Let's see, some more shoes, jewelry, all of that fun stuff. And then all of my purses are hanging on this little rack right there. All right, you guys, that wraps up today's video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Hopefully now you feel inspired to clean out your own closets or whatever space in your home needs a little cleaning and organizing. That is the goal of this video. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up, comment below, as well as subscribe. I upload new videos every Tuesday and Friday, so stay tuned for those. Bye, guys.